Good morning, guys. I uh, just want to thank everybody for for being here. Uh, I just said 31,000. I appreciate it. Um, got Beaver. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Once more. So good. But uh, I appreciate it. Uh, you have to check out this video. I just about, I had a giant beaver on and it almost took my, my trap and everything. So thanks for being here. Thanks for watching. Thanks for supporting. What's up everyone. Looks like it's going to be a nice morning. Uh, I walked all the way to the other end in the dark. A lot of muskrats swimming around. I can't figure out how I haven't got one in a uh, drowner yet, but it's possible. I did catch one yesterday where I caught the coyote in the pocket set and the uh, something come along looked like coyote tracks ate my muskrat so I'm thinking about getting all my hag brackets out setting it up periodically with some bait but I don't know beautiful day got a sun the sunrise coming up I don't know if it'll come out in the GoPro or not but let's go over here. We got our first critter. <laughs> grinner, grinner. Was it winter, winter, grinner? Chicken, grinner, dinner, winter, center? Something like that. Let me come over here and get rid of some stuff out of my pocket. And 220s are hard to find when you're. You gotta be careful. The old pocket or a uh, caster mound. We got a salsa rat king. So we'll get him taken care of. Get him off, reset. But I don't know what's all down that way. It was dark. I was like, I'll just go to the other end and start my way back. Let it be somewhat light out when I get back. So, waiters. I get really tired of walking all the way in with the waders on. It looks like a freaking beaver track right there. The old coon got in there and plugged it. Actually, a pretty good sized coon. Yeah, it ain't as big as I thought it was. I got off work a little bit early, so it was still dark when I got here. There's just debris out of here. You can do a lot of this stuff in the bank. You don't have to have waiters most of the time. It's just easier to not have to flop around out in the mud. There we go. There you go. I ain't even gonna put nothing on it. It's still there, I can smell it. It's got a big pile on it still. Go get the old possum out. different. I think it was a big bull. Big old bullfrog.
So... I drowned her. Well, it's supposed to be right there. Now it's way out there. Very strange. I can't tell if there's anything on there. Probably not. Should be able to see it, I think. That's very strange, though. Hold it out of the ground like that. Here's where yeah, I got a lied about not needing waders. You end up needing waders. Get what? Holy Jesus. That would be why. It's a big one. It's a big old beaver right there. He pulled that. Ground her out, freaking. Dang. Got him by two toes, looks like. God dang. Wow. <laughs> that one's a stud. Oh, that's interesting. Huh. I just can't believe he pulled that. Thank God that uh, big old washer on the end held her in the bottom. Right over there, some, there's some sign of beavers right there. I see one swimming up that way. Right in front of me, there's a beaver. There's definitely some beaver in here. It's pretty thick. Actually, here in a little bit, I'll show you. I lost a, a one and a half duke yesterday due to a beaver. I'm sure that wolf fang held on as long as it could. See where that beaver goes. If, if it'll tell me where its hole is, that'd be awesome. <sighs> I want to get that back into some solid ground again, like it was. Ouch! There's the old thumb in the trap again. Dang it! You big dummy. It's all muddy. The old thumb in the trap. Trevor J specialty. <laughs> it, it sure does seem like it's a pretty common deal now. <sighs> this is where I made that fake slide, guys. You remember? Well, there was a, there was already a slide here, but I, I made it so they had a focal point that they went up. There we go. Oh, that's beautiful. Put that right up here. I definitely needed to, next time I make some steaks, I need to make some. See, that went in so solid though. Shouldn't have got pulled up. It's a hell of a beaver. See where ready you go. They're going up to cut some trees and he got it. Busted. It's a big one, it's gonna be fun to carry out. Dang. <laughs> I still see that sucker down there swimming. I bet it lives right here. Something came out just right over that way when I walked down here. He's gonna come investigate. That is a huge beaver. It's gonna be so much fun to carry.
They've been working on that guy. Still ain't caught nothing in there yet. That's surprising. My waders are frozen. Oh, that's better. <laughs> That's the second one that I've come here was drowned. Knocked over on it. <clears throat> oh, he's a little guy. A wee little feller. There's no, uh, Catch and release when they're kaput when you get here. size track. I must have knocked it over and said heck with it. Pretty cold the last couple nights. Pocket set look even better. Slicked her all up for me, buddy. Oh, it drops off right here. That's where the coyote was caught. All right, got a coon pocket set. We'll get her taken care of, and that's pretty much going to be it for the for this one. still on there a little chewed on but a couple caster mounds on each end of this. See where something's climbing there too. I'm gonna try to get that beaver that has my trap. I'm gonna put one on each side. Eventually the coons will be caught and I won't have to worry about them messing up my sets but Till then, sucker, somewhere along here. What are you so mean for? <laughs> They're more aggressive than most coons. Crazy guy. Actually, just toe cut. Probably better get him taken care of before he does get me. He's only caught by a little bit of his toe. Man, 
Really by one toe. I'm sure glad he didn't get off there and come at me. Literally one toe. Trap still over there. Looks like it's just gonna be one coon from here.